in addition to ease in navigation, Microsoft has also added some new functionality in the sales and receivable setup. Let's take a look at that. Go to our sales and receivable. And here we have two new fields, default item quantity and create item from description. A lot of companies have the sales item on the line with a value of one. Most of the time, the quantity will be one. This option allows you to have the system automatically enter a quantity of one. If it happens to be more, you can certainly override that. But since your default is one, the system will automatically enter that, alleviating the need to enter in a quantity of one. Create item from description allows you to create a new item at the sales order for an item that you're entering in that is new and use the description that you're entering in order to be able to create that new item. You don't have to leave the sales order, go to the item master, create the item, come back to the sales order, and then continue on. The system will allow you to create it right there on the fly. Let's go see how these work. New. Show fewer fields. Enter in our customer number. Enter. Enter in our requested date. Enter. Takes us right to the type. It's an item. 1,000. It's our bicycle, and the quantity of one automatically appears. Again, I can override that, but it now allows me to quickly get down to the next line. And here I'm going to type in a new item. And I hit this, I hit enter. The system is now saying that item does not exist. Do you want to create the new item? for the description of new item or do you want to select from the item master perhaps you've entered in a, a wrong description uh, and the item does exist so you can choose from that in this example we'll say we don't have that item in the item master i want to create the new item i say okay the system allows me to use the template that we want to default from for the new item i'll choose the retail item template Here I've used series numbers. My description is already there. Other information that I needed is already associated with my template. I simply say OK. And now I have the new item with the default quantity of one. So those are some of the ways that Microsoft has enhanced Dynamics NAV.